Weather rate certified most accurate forecast in Central Texas. This is Fox 44 weather with Chief Meteorologist Mike LaPointe. It's been another hot and humid day today. Temperatures climbing to 93 degrees here in Waco and temperatures slowly trying to cool off a bit, but there's a lot of humidity in the air, so it's going to have a hard time cooling off. 91 degrees, the current temperature here in Waco. It's 89 down toward Temple as well as Colleen. Mejia checks in right at 87 degrees and the numbers jump with the humidity. This is the heat index or what it feels like. Feels like 95 degrees right now in Waco, but as you work your way down toward the Brazos Valley, look at that again. Giddings feels like 101 degrees at this moment. Georgetown feels like 94. Satellite photograph with the uh, visible picture shows the clouds still streaming in from the southeast. So we have some spots right now that are seeing some sunshine out there. The clouds will be on the increase and with that southeast breeze also indicates that we're seeing some more moisture move into our area as well. Over toward the Lubbock area and the Panhandle, you can see those bright white clouds. Those are those tall cumulonimbus clouds, the thunderstorms, those will be staying out over the Panhandle and those won't affect us whatsoever. Back here though, what is affecting us? The strong wind. Wind has been out of the southeast today about 15 to 30 miles per hour. And our current wind here in Waco at 29. It's 24 in Temple, 28 right now in the Hillsboro area, and over toward Brownwood, southeast winds at 28 miles per hour. So future cast this evening, the clouds will start to thicken up once again as temperatures slowly start to fall. By midnight, we're looking at temperatures mid to upper 70s, and then overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning. Really not dropping too much farther than that. Low to mid 70s. That is it for the low temperatures. Mostly cloudy skies. There could be some spotty drizzle here and there, but that's just that moisture moving into our area. And then as we hit the afternoon hours, a few breaks, but looks high and dry with your Friday afternoon topping out into the upper 80s and lower 90s. For tonight, though, increasing clouds. It'll be warm and breezy. 74 degrees, the low temperature. And then tomorrow, some clouds in the morning, and then partly sunny skies in the afternoon. Another breezy and humid day. Our high tops out right at 91. As we look ahead, here's the long range forecast. A mix of sun and clouds on Saturday, 92, 91 on Sunday. Memorial Day, partly to mostly sunny, 92 degrees will be the high. And we're going to keep it in the 90s, at least on Tuesday. Slight chance of rain late in the day, but that just kind of shows maybe a little weather pattern shift right now. And that'll cool us off maybe into the mid to upper 80s starting by the end of next week. But again, just stay tuned for that. And down toward the Brazos Valley, a mix of sun and clouds, temperatures low 90s for the actual high temperatures. You factor in the humidity and maybe in the upper 90s here and those nighttime lows in the 70s. Any